Good morning, everyone. We are continuing here in the Kitzer Shulchan Aruch in the laws of prohibited activities on Shabbos. And we are still in the halacha of the malacha, of the prohibited activity of kshira umatira, which means tying and untying. And he writes like this, Kesher, Shasur la say any knot that is prohibited to make on Shabbos, as we discussed last time, knots that are professional knots, knots that are double knots, knots that are made to last for more than 24 hours, any of those knots which you're not allowed to tie on Shabbos itself, kesher kezeh asun gam lahatir. So this is gam kein, also this, you're not allowed to untie it. So if you have a double knot, you have a professional knot, you have a slip knot, you have something that was made to last for more than 24 hours, then that also you're not going to be allowed to untie. That's the malacha of, of matir, of untying things. However, if you're in a situation where leaving the knot intact is going to cause pain, so we'll have to see what that is, you would be allowed to have a non-Jew come and untie that knot. So perhaps an example of this would be if a person tied some kind of a double knot on the shoe on Shabbos, which Midrabanan, a person is not allowed to do, and the shoes are stuck on his feet and he cannot get them off. So that's pain on Shabbos, that's tsar, that's anguish, and that's being uncomfortable. And therefore, even though that you yourself would not be allowed to untie the double knot, but to ask a non-Jew to come and untie the knot so you can remove your shoes, that would be permitted. Now the Mishnah writes, that it's also permitted to have such a knot untied by a non-Jew, even if it's just great necessity, meaning there's pain and there's great necessity. So if something is really paining you and you need the knot to be untied in order to remove the discomfort that is there, so then you can ask a non-Jew to do that for you. So too, says the Mishnah Bura, even if it's just great necessity, there's something that you need to get to in your kitchen so you can serve it to your guests. And the only and it has a double knot in there. And there's no way for you to untie it because it's Shabbos. So you want to ask the cleaning lady, the maid, the neighbor down the street to come and untie the bag of food over here so that you'll be able to serve it to your guests. That would be considered great necessity and you would be allowed to do such a thing. Those are the halachas for today. Have a wonderful day. Agutavach and a Shavuot Tov.